Hello guys, welcome back to another video. So we're gonna do a quick uh, part from the Hiraga project because a subscriber he commented in one video and he asked me when I have a little time to make a video in wiring the power supply because he got all the components and he's trying to make his own Hiraga amplifier. So let me pronounce his name. I don't know if I'm going to pronounce it correctly. I write it on the paper because his name is really long. So it's Mr. Ioannis Papachatsopoulos. I hope I pronounce it correctly. So yeah, he asked me when I have time to make a video on how to wiring the power supply. So in order to do this video, I needed to do a temporary front panel on my amplifier if you can see here because I'm still working on the chassis on the enclosure so I'm waiting from Vishal to send me that uh, plexiglass for the top and then to see how I'm gonna do a 3d print here to cover the transformer and let uh, displace the capacitors so without further ado Let's jump into this video and show how I did my power supply part. Okay guys, so this is how look my temporary front panel and this is how look all my wiring inside so you can see the speakers, the potentiometer for volume, the inputs, the boards, the speaker protections, the two transformers over there, the big capacitors, the two rectifiers, bridge, the fuses so this is how locks almost finished as I say I'm waiting for visual to repair me this plexiglass to, mo to mount it here in the top and then to see a 3d print how to cover these transformers so here I draw a little schematic how I wiring how I wiring everything there and uh, let's start from the mains so here I have the 245 volts AC mains that come to power the two transformers, the big one and the small one. My transformer has two separate secondary wirings to dual 24 volts. So here I have dual 24 and here I have another dual 24. So then each one secondary wiring is going to be rectified by uh, each individual rectifier bro, uh, bridge and you can see, see it's coming this one to the ground to the middle point of the capacitor here and this one is coming same to the middle capacitor the other capacitors and then I have the positive negative and then I have again positive and negative so the capacitors are 40,000 microfarads uh, with 80 volts four of them so I have two per channel and two per channel that is coming the positive zero negative the small transformer has also dual 12 volts and I have two diodes that I'm making the 12 volts here positive and is going to power my uh, speaker protection board and then the zero here it will gonna be all grounded so ground 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 I'm going to hook up the speakers and to put signal on and we're gonna have a sound test so as I say this is a video just because he requests to see how he's uh, wearing the power supply but uh, once I'm gonna have finished with the plexiglass and all the enclosure done definitely I'm gonna do also as I say a THD test oscilloscope test and all these tests to understand how good it is this uh, amplifier on all the measurements so as you can see guys I have this uh, two equipment that uh, we shall uh, bring me over because uh, I'm still learning how to use Arta 
software with uh, this uh, sound card and with this uh, auto ranging uh, system that uh, you hook up the output from your amplifier and doesn't matter how many volts you have in the output maybe let's see 20 volts AC in the output this auto ranging it's always give you only one volt on the output like that you put on the input of the sound card and your sound card connected to the computer and Arta software will gonna read the performance like THD and noise and all stuff from your amplifier. So I'm going to use this uh, little beer preamplifier. So this is how it looks a bit. We shall bring it to me to adjust the potentiometer because it has some issues so I fix it. So it's a really nice sound preamplifier, a small one. And it's doing really well, especially with the My Hiraga. Definitely is doing a really nice pair of uh, audio gear. So here how it looks together. So little bit preamplifier with Hiraga amplifier. So let's have a sound test right now. Okay guys, so let's power on the amplifier. The fire is on, there is no hum, there is no no any noise. And I'm gonna just cover also this speaker because as you can see I just keep it open to show how is the layout of these speakers. So let's cover this one and then play the music. And now let's press play. Definitely is a non copyrighted music, okay? the sound it sounds really nice sound really pure
guys, so this is, was the test with the sound. I look, I hope you like it. And uh, yeah, no, no noise. Definitely, I'm gonna come with the next uh, part when I'm gonna do all the measurements once I'm gonna have also the enclosure done. I hope you enjoy watching this video, guys. I say this video was just a request by my subscriber because he said that he has all the parts and he wants to assemble, he wants to make his amplifier Hiraga. So that's why I come with this video just to show how to connect all the power supply. Then, definitely I'm gonna have the final video on this project once I'm gonna have everything done, the chassis and the enclosure because I'm gonna have a word with Vishal in order to make a 3D print for the transformer, to cover the transformer and I'm gonna have plexiglass over here and plexiglass also on the front panel so please subscribe, activate the notification bell, stay tuned uh, guys and uh, as I say soon I'm gonna come with the final part of this project until the next video bye bye guys and have a good day